Hello my wonderful biotechnicians and welcome back to our YouTube channel. So today we are back with an NDDB trainee vacancies and that too for MSc Life Sciences, Biotech and Microbiology candidates. So let's take a look at the details and let's see if non-net candidates are also eligible to apply for this. NDDB, which is the National Dairy Development Board, is recruiting for trainee R&D laboratory to be located at Hyderabad and there are four vacancies available. So what is the description? So NDDB offers an excellent work environment with considerable freedom from, for innovative activities and also provides great learning opportunities to work in teams of individuals who are highly qualified, competent and committed to the organizational objectives. So if you're looking for a very challenging or mildly challenging work opportunity, so then keep watching this video. So the job category is animal health. The designation is trainee and like I said, it's located in Hyderabad. So four vacancies are available. Age limit that is candidates above 27 years of age as of 1st November 2022 need not apply. So what is the profile summary? So what you'll be doing is to assist in research and development activities related to bovine disease diagnosis and control of bovine diseases. So what are some of the key roles and responsibilities as a trainee at NDDB? So understanding and assistance in the following technical procedures that is immunoassays such as ELISA for bovine design screen, disease screening, processing bovine clinical specimens, nucleic acid extraction, molecular assays, PCR and real-time PCR. I hope you know that Biotechnica has a couple of workshops that have been lined up for you. We just finished a qPCR one and we have a flow cytometry one which will happen soon. So if you haven't checked that out, do check it out. It's a, going to be an awesome event because we even have speakers from abroad who are going to help you in this workshop. So do check out the link in our description box for the same. Moving along or uh, coming back to the job. So technical assistance in standardization and validation of new methodologies and assays, support in documentation and record keeping for the maintenance of quality management systems as per international standards, any other scientific, technical and documentation assistance may be required. So what are the qualifications and experiences needed to apply for these trainee vacancies? So MSc Life Sciences Biotechnology Microbiology is the qualification that they are looking at and I don't see net qualification mentioned anywhere so it's probably safe to say so non-net candidates can apply. So MSc Life Sciences Biotech Microbiology non-net candidates are eligible to apply. So what are some of the other essential attributes and skills? So they've divided it into technical and managerial. So technical basic understanding of laboratory techniques that is bacterial isolation, nucleic acid extraction, molecular biology techniques, good microbiological practice and procedures, basic understanding of biochemistry and calculations, good communication and writing skills, competent in using Microsoft Office, that is Excel, Word and PowerPoint. So some managerial skills, our candidates should be able to work effectively in a team, plan, schedule and execute the work that is assigned, should have a strong aptitude for learning and research, should be self-motivated, dedicated and hardworking and should orient self to the organizational goals, requirements and values. So this traineeship position is for a period of one year and is further extendable for one more year. So the last date for receiving the applications is 19th of November 2022. So you have a few days left to apply for this, roughly more than 10 days. And this is an online application process as well. So if you just click on this, apply online, it will take you to the page which has all of the details which you can read for yourself and you can click on apply for these vacancies. So this looks like a very nice opportunity. So if you lo are looking to expand your skills, so do apply for these trainee vacancies and it's in R&D, MSc Life Sciences candidates can apply and like I said, non-net, so MSc Life Sciences, Biotech and Microbiology candidates can apply, apply online. Okay, so online application process. I hope this video was helpful for you and I hope that you're following us on all of our social media, especially on our Telegram and WhatsApp groups because people over there have already seen this opportunity and also they are privy to more other opportunities and announcements that we make. So do ensure that you join us over there. Leave a like on this video, let us know in the comments what are the types of videos we can make for you. I hope you are enjoying the recent 
spate of videos that we've put out for you they are all very le relevant to your career and even exam related so turn on your post notification so that you don't miss out on these videos and there's also an ask me anything session that happens with shaker sir regularly so do watch out for that as well where all of your queries will be answered by our experts and of course by shaker sir and like i said before there we have workshops as well so check out the stores page at biotechnica for more details on the workshop okay so all the very best we'll see you in our next one take care